I met Byron when he was coming to work at Blackstone. He was a very special man. He played his heart out in what he did. He was not stopping. He was always a student of the game. He always wanted to learn and he always wanted to help other people. He was such a beloved figure at Morgan Stanley. He was really one of the few people that was unafraid to speak truth to power. The main message I got from Byron is just to live life as full as you can. And he just inspired you to always keep pushing. We have some uh, sad news to share. One of Wall Street's most prominent uh, investors, Byron Wien, has died. In October of 2023, we lost a legend. Byron Wien was a gentle giant, and not only a titan of Wall Street, but also one of the kindest, most humble people in the world of finance. Byron touched the lives of so many people all around the globe, including us here at Blue Fox Advisors. Over the past 30 years, Byron was always a supportive colleague, a mentor, and a friend. He was curious, intelligent, bright. We talked about everything, uh, not just markets, we also talked about life, and I liked him for that. You can talk to him about anything, he was so knowledgeable, and he had this very smooth, comforting manner about him. He was just a lovely fellow. He had such a nice, gentle, calm, smart way about him. He's a good person, and he brought a lot of enthusiasm to what he did. And his success supports the view that the only way to be successful in life is to do what you love and love what you do. He loved what he did, he brought a high degree of enthusiasm for it, and a total commitment. So, you know, thinking very kindly of Byron, I got a lot of good ideas on how to think from him. Every strategist is going to sort of model the approach to markets and life and should off of his wisdom. His words of wisdom are words that we should carry for life, constantly exploring what are the surprises and how should we think about the world are a reminder to keep learning, keep growing. I will never forget this. He said, I was never afraid to lose my job because the only thing I really needed in life was a roof over my head and a New York City library card. And actually, even though he's known as a financial whiz and was a great financial mind, he actually knew a lot about history and was very interested in it. I will greatly miss him for that reason, among many others. He was a special guy and I'm going to miss him. Your Morgan Stanley family loves you and will always remember you. He was a wonderful man. He was an intellectual father to me. He was a friend, a mentor, and I'll miss him tremendously.